Yo, what's up guys, it's the Goblin. Today what I have for you guys, 118 kill domination playing on the Xbox and I'm using the MSMC silencer fast mags. But today's video, I'm going to give you guys some real tips on how to get 100 plus kills. I'm going to keep it real because I know lots of you guys who, you know, watch YouTube videos want to be able to get these similar score lines to what I'm getting. So I'm going to give you guys some real tips that might actually, you know, help you guys quite a bit on how to get these uh, high kill games. So the first thing that I'm going to say is it, the lobby is, is highly dependent. You know, it depends on how good your teammates are and how bad the enemies are obviously if you get up against a full team of prestigers like 10th prestigers it's going to be a lot harder to get 100 plus kills although i have done it against full parties of master prestigers but it's a lot easier when you get uh, a team of noobs on the enemy team and when your teammates are actually decent so that's the first tip i'll give you guys is uh there's nothing much you can do to uh to you know find noobs you got to kind of get lucky but when you do get lucky when you do get those in those lobbies with noobs that is when you got to capitalize and that's a real tip on how to get high killing gameplays is the enemies do make the gameplay quite a bit the second tip i give you guys is you got to have the right class setups and class setups are so important you can look at some of the class setups that i use in my videos and uh you know implement those into your game like right here in this gameplay i'm using uh, flak jacket hardline scavenger toughness and then dexterity i think it is and then i'm using the M the MSMC, sorry, I almost said MP7, with silencer and fast mix. That's a real class, and this is a class that is fairly easy to get 100 plus kills with. The next thing is the kill streaks. Obviously, if you guys watch these videos, you should know which kill streaks you're going to have to use to get 100 plus kills. You're going to probably want to use the VSAT, the dogs, or the swarm, or any sort of combination that involves the swarm or the dogs is usually what is used to get 100 plus. I know I've gotten it with all sorts of different combinations, but definitely the easiest ones are to use the swarm and the dogs because when you get both those in, they get about 25, 30 kills combined and then obviously the VSAT helps out your whole team which is kind of it's kind of bad though sometimes when you call in the VSAT your teammates can steal your kills but it's also a really good uh, really good kill streak to use because when you get it you get the VSAT assist obviously which helps you work your way all the way up to get that 100 plus gameplay the next tip I'll give you guys is you have to have the right map and you have to have the map knowledge and what is map knowledge it's basically knowing the hot spots of the map so I know the hot spots of this map right here so let me just explain it the enemies are, are spawned in a domination where are the hot spots going to be they're going to be at the ways coming out of a domination if that makes sense so one would be right there in the middle of building they can come out from there they can come out from here on the left or on the right side so i'm going to control those hot spots there's a guy coming up and once you know all the hot spots on the maps you know where the traffic patterns are where enemies you, you know usually locate it makes it a lot easier and that is basically the map knowledge is knowing the uh where the hot spots are another part of map knowledge is knowing where the enemy spawns are and this is much more important if you are a huge go out rusher and use an SMG class which um you know, I'd recommend using an SMG class if you're going for your first 100 plus, and you want to rush it, but you don't want to rush it too much. You know, you want to rush it, and then when you get closer to a kill streak, kind of sit back a little bit, as I do right here. You know, this is how I like to play. I see there's a few guys up there. I don't really want to run right in there. I gotta sit back, and I'm able to get my dogs, and then I think I'm able to pick up the swarm as well in this life, because uh, I just wait here. I have the blackbird up. No point in rushing them. I pop around the corner and get those kills that are necessary. So that's another thing is you gotta have the right map, and you gotta be able to know the spawns on the map. It's, knowing spawns is so important in Call of Duty, especially if you you play game modes such as Domination, Free For All. In, in TDM and Kill Confirmed, how you determine the spawns is basically the, wherever your teammates are, you know, teammates usually like to bunch up, your random teammates, and wherever your teammates are, the exact opposite side of the minimap is where most of the enemy, enemies are. So basically in TDM and Kill Confirmed, you want to stay as far away from your teammates as possible, but in Domination it's a bit different. You basically just want to rush the enemies and know where they're at and uh, basically know the spawn points for dom for the Domination spots. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Hopefully some of these tips are a lot more, a lot useful. If you guys have any other tips, leave them down in the comment section below. You guys can discuss, you know, how to get these plus gameplays in the comment section and uh, hopefully this is a video that you guys enjoyed some real tips I want to give you guys real tips because that's the point of my channel is to bring you guys impressive gameplays and to teach you guys how to do this yourself so hopefully you guys did enjoy this if you did could you go ahead and smash that like button for me maybe we could even hit 2,000 likes on this video that would be much appreciated if you guys could all leave a like for me and as always subscribe for a cookie I'm out peace I think somebody's watching over me Tell me, world, did I pass your test? Did I do this right? Please tell me I need you now, please help me Cause life don't come with no manual I played the cards that you tell me My life is on the line every time I rhyme Always on the grind 24-7 So much on my mind, someone please remind me Did I'll be fine, where am I heading to the fans? My life I owe you, so close to my heart I hold you But to anyone who ever thought of doubting me I'm so proud to say that I told you